The Little Mermaid Ariel enchanted friendship, once upon a time, deep in the magical waters of the ocean, there lived a young mermaid named Ariel. She was curious, adventurous, and loved to explore the world above the sea. Ariel had a beautiful, shimmering tail, and her long red hair flowed like the waves. But more than anything, she loved making new friends. One sunny day, as Ariel swam near the shore, she saw a group of dolphins playing in the waves. They leaped and twirled in the air, splashing water everywhere. Ariel giggled and joined them, her tail splashing the sea as she danced along, but something was different that day. As Ariel swam closer to the dolphins, she noticed something glowing beneath the surface of the water. It was a tiny, sparkling stone. Curious, Ariel dove down and picked it up. It was smooth and warm, and it shimmered like a star. Just then, a soft voice whispered, Thank you, Ariel. Ariel's eyes widened in surprise. Who said that? She asked, looking around. From the glowing stone, a tiny creature appeared. She had delicate wings, sparkling like the moon, and she was the size of a seahorse. Ariel was amazed. Who are you? She asked. The little creature smiled. I am Coral, a sea fairy. You have found the enchanted friendship stone. It has the power to bring friends together, no matter where they are, Ariel's eyes sparkled. I love making friends. How can I use the stone? Coral fluttered her wings. The stone only works when it is used with a kind heart. It will help you meet new friends and create a magical bond between you all, Ariel thought for a moment. I have an idea. I want to bring my best friends together. I have Flounder, my fish friend, and Sebastian, the crab who loves to sing. Maybe the stone can help us all become even closer, Coral nodded. That's a wonderful idea, Ariel. Just hold the stone close to your heart and think of your friends. Ariel did just that. She closed her eyes, held the enchanted friendship stone tight, and thought of Flounder and Sebastian. She imagined all the fun adventures they'd had and how much she cared for them. As she did, the stone began to glow brighter, in an instant, Flounder and Sebastian appeared beside her. Flounder giggled, his fins twitching excitedly. Sebastian tapped his claws to the rhythm of a song, his face beaming with joy. They were both surprised but happy to see the glowing stone, did you do this, Ariel? Flounder asked, his eyes wide, Ariel smiled. Yes. This is the enchanted friendship stone. It brought us together and made our friendship even stronger, Sebastian chuckled. I always knew we were meant to be the best of friends, and so, Ariel, Flounder, and Sebastian spent the rest of the day playing in the ocean, laughing, and singing together. They were united in the magic of friendship, and the enchanted friendship stone shimmered in the water, reminding them of the power of kindness and love. From that day on, Ariel knew that true friendship could create the most beautiful magic of all.